only doing because they're afraid of getting bullied again. Bullying is one of the many modern day problems that should be eliminated as soon as possible. Ladies and gentlemen, so my three points here, I will explain to you why are people bullied and be a bully. How does bully affect the victim and what can we do to stop them? But before I begin, I will explain to you the definition of bully. According to Wikipedia, bully may be defined as the activity of prevented aggressive behavior intent toward another individual, psychically, mentally, or emotionally. Bully is characterized by an individual behaving in certain ways to gain power over another person, and it can be classified into four types: psycho, verbal, relational, and the last, which is the most frequent they happen in this day, is cyberbullying. And there's a sample like school bullying or even bully teacher. Have you ever disrespected a teacher by not doing your homework or talk back to them? Well, some teachers might even quit their job or retire newly just because of getting bullied by kids or her students. So back to my first point about why are people bullied and being a bully? Ladies and gentlemen, some people being bullied because the way they look, the way they dress, the way they act, their religion, their sexual orientation, or even because of simple things like they were glasses or overweight. I mean, that's really a small thing, but people make jokes about it. That doesn't make any sense. And people can also start bullying from parental influence, television, and video games with fighting in it. And they, they often do that to make themselves feel important. And it can start during that short period of time because of low supervision. So what about the victim of this bullying thing? What about them? But some people that are the victim of bullying will usually show no emotion about how they feel or always show it. Some people might say that keeping up your silence don't want inside you go back, but it actually is because it can lead to mental breakdown and even make you think of very bad times. Have you ever have a friend that wouldn't really talk much and you didn't really understand what was wrong with them? Well, they will either be bullied or had a major problem at home, but you probably wouldn't understand and didn't really do anything about it because you might